Good day everyone, my name is Omeka from Really Nice Shirts and today I'm talking to you about the types of shirt every man should own. The polo shirt. The polo shirt comprises of three buttons, a placket and an optional pocket. Polo shirts are usually short sleeves. They are used by the polo players originally in India in 1859 and Great Britain during the 1920s. Really comfortable and I think anybody or everybody should own a polo shirt. Oxford button down shirt. The Oxford button down shirt is a type of woven dress shirt fabric employed to make dress shirts sometimes called Oxford shirts worn on casual to formal occasions. They usually have button down styles on the collar which eliminates the problem of collar flopping and laying around flat and disappearing underneath the jacket collar. The Oxford shirt is often after the specific weave of the fabric called, you guessed it, Oxford cloth. The dress shirt. The dress shirt, Cambridge Dictionary gives the definition of a dress shirt as a formal shirt, usually for men, intended to be worn with the jacket and tie. Now, here's the thing that gets a bit tricky. The term dress shirt has different meanings on both sides of the Atlantic. In the United Kingdom, a dress shirt is known as a formal shirt. In the United States, the dress shirt makes part of the standard ensemble required for evening dress for a formal occasion. A man will be required to wear a dress shirt, which essentially must be white with double French cuffs and French and cufflinks actually. Most times they could mix it up with a tuxedo and a butterfly bat wing black tie. Most times you could wear it for a cocktail dinner, black tie event. You know when you say black tie events, that's you could wear a nice dress shirt with the tux on it. The Cuban collar shirt. The Cuban collar shirt basically is a shirt which is more relaxed. You know, open collar, short sleeves, straight hem, and it provides a casual, smart look that has proven to be flattering in all body shapes. I mean, you could wear it if you know a bit chubby, or if you're skinny, or you're built. And it's actually for anybody that even with the broadened upper body and it's straight down on the sides. The overshirt. The overshirt, which is a shirt worn over another shirt or another clothing without being tucked into the waistband. So you could wear the shirt on top of another shirt and still look good. Kind of like a flannel. But not a flannel, because the next one we're talking about is the flannel shirt. The flannel shirt is a soft woven cloth, various fittings and flannel shirts was originally made for carded wool and uh, yarn. Office shirt. The office shirt is a garment with the collar and a full length opening at the front, which is normally buttoned and worn to formal events. The next one we're talking about is the chambray shirt. The chambray shirt is a cotton plain weave fabric made with dyed warp yarn, actually. It's, it's a funny word, sorry, I can't pronounce it. <laughs> warp yarn. And it's the yarn is typically light blue. And the chambray is lighter and it's woven differently and it has a soft texture, more than, softer than denim and it's, and it's thinner in construction. So, uh, chambray are like uh, blue denim shirts that are not actually denim but soft enough and they are blue. Then the classic short sleeve. The classic short sleeve is normal short sleeve with an extended shoulder and shortened sleeves and an armhole will provide uh, covering for your arms actually. The denim shirt. The denim shirt is what I was talking about. Is sometimes people mistake the denim for the chambray, but the, sh the chambray is different from the denim in ways that the denim usually refers to a cotton twill fabric meaning it is di diagonally woven and made up of two threads. You could wear a denim shirt to the bar, you could wear it in the, on Fridays, you know, calm Fridays, and if you're just going somewhere like uh, a barbecue. So those are all the shirts that you need to know. This is a Mecca signing out. I know you already know that you should like our post right there and share. Uh, you can also come and get any of these shirts at number 39 Adenero Gunsoya Surulere and on our Instagram, really nice shirts. Thank you very much. Peace.